This is actually just off the old mill on one of the venels off the side. So it takes just sometimes it's worth actually just stopping and having a look. This is just actually in a city <laughs> off Royal Mile. And look at this. King James the seventh uh, ordained that the mortification of those Moody granted in 1649 to build a church uh, should be applied to the erection of this structure. Right, okay. Okay. Right, this is Outlander territory here folks. That is the printing shop of Jamie Fraser in Outlander. So they used this set in Outlander. Oh, right, okay. so basically that was supposed to be a printing shop right. up there. Um, I had his sign across there, across that old building because of the wooden, the wooden structure. Yeah. So this is all Outlander scene. house loads of places to go and see in all independent shops and some of it is very cliche Scottish stuff um, but you just have to look at the buildings and you have to look at um, what people are offering and Terry do. Oh, he's across the street. <laughs> Safely. <laughs> Good lad. Oh, what's he doing? Oh, Terry. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> so, uh, yes, um, that's how to take a picture when there's no traffic. Um, so, it's all very, very cool. It's 
the Christmas shop there. Scotland shop, Scottish sweets and treats, tours of Scotland, Minky Tell we are. <laughs> Taste of Edinburgh. There's loads of You want something with tartan on it, you've got it. You pick something, you've got tartan on it, it's Okay guys, so if you haven't actually worked out, Terry and myself are at the Fringe in Edinburgh and it is wild, absolutely wild. So this guy's playing music, this guy's struggling. Um, yeah, uh, my eyes are all over the place. Uh, we're on the Royal Mail just now, we've had a full day out and we're just taking it all in towards the end of the day. So, it's cool, it's very cool to the thing, very arty, lots of stuff going on. So there's magicians, um, singers, artists, um, that's the city chambers, that's the city chambers in there, that's the Royal Mail down there. Strictly. Okay, I don't know. I'm going to mention somebody in this video, but walking with Tamsin, I want you to have a look at this. 
and see what you think. I know you're the man for the job on this. Let me know, okay? Tamson, you know who you are. Give us a give us a call out. Give us a shout out here on this. You should be here doing this. <laughs> He's done really well. Is he a street performer, or is he just? Is he really good at what he's doing, or is that a statue? Don't know. Jury's out. There you go. The Writers Museum. Just look at this. This is just superb. The architecture and the history, the historic side of things. Absolutely phenomenal. And again, another Robert Burns place. So you guys have checked out my Brigadoon stuff. Um, the man got about a bit. The man definitely got about a bit, and he clearly enjoyed staying at some very interesting places. The one of this one, this one included. What does that say? What does that say? Lawn Market Housing is Action Area, 1988 to 91, restored with the grants from the Secretary of State for Scotland and the City of Edinburgh District Council. It's not kind of old. Descriptions, tartan, lots of tartan. <laughs> Scottish War Poets Corner. Sweet be their sleep now, wherever they're lying, far through they be from the hills of their home. Unveiled by Her Majesty's Right Honourable Lord Lieutenant and Lord Provost of City of Edinburgh, Frank Ross, in November 2018. And that's really nice, that. Like that. Oh, this is cool wee cafe bit at the back. What does that say? It says, Fear the Lord and depart from evil. 1622. Let's mark it. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> so we've got down here. Oh, look. Teddy going all action man on us. 
<laughs> you were caught good old action man there, good man. You're like, I'm getting the shot, I'm getting that shot, and I don't care how I do it. Like. This down here, folks, is got the inspiration in the area where J.K. Rowling wrote the Harry Potter books. It's around here. Why the chief? So 